After hosting some of the best competitors in the region during a leg of the Peace Country Curling Tour, the action at the Dawson Creek Curling Club will be a little more casual on Friday. Dinner and doubles and a turkey shoot. So we've done a, a Christmas theme. Obviously, we're going to be uh, um, serving a good meal, a turkey dinner, full turkey dinner with, uh, with the Christmas theme. And, you know, come in your pajamas or your uh, ugly Christmas sweater or whatever you like and uh, we'll kind of make it a fun evening from there. The event will sort of cap off a half season for the rink. On Tuesday nights the past two months, people looking to get into or back into the sport have been competing in a relatively non-competitive league. We tried to attract some new members early in the year by offering a split season. So we had a six-pack that was uh, six nights of league curling and a couple nights of free instruction that lasted until Christmas. Uh, we're obviously just about done that, so we're offering a baker's dozen after Christmas. So you get 12 nights of league play plus a free night of instruction. Ginter says that he believes most of the people that signed up for the six-pack will be back in the new year, but he'd like to see even more register for the baker's dozen. I'd encourage any Anybody, whether they're um, you know old young experienced or not to come and, and join us on Tuesday night it's gonna be fun and they're having a blast there's lots of high-fiving and lots of hooting and hollering and I think our regular mixed league is taking some notes so it's fun to watch if you're on the fence about trying the sport Ginter says that it's quite easy for beginners but of course making advanced shots like you might see from Kevin Martin or Jennifer Jones takes years of practice. Before you're done your first night we'll have you throwing rocks to the other end safely and you'll probably make a few shots. So yeah it's reasonably easy to pick up. Um, if you watch it on TV at all though you can see how skilled it can be as well. So it's a, a great game for a, a whole variety of different skill levels. The club can also provide you with the majority of the equipment needed to try the sport. After a holiday break to end December, the rink will be buzzing once again in the new year with a number of exciting events on tap. And actually we've got three events in January. We've got the Oilman's annual bond spiel. Um, we've got our senior men's and ladies district playdowns uh, that are occurring here in Dawson. And then on the third, week of, third weekend of January, um, after we start play, we're doing our farmers and annual mixed bond spiel. Derek Lightfoot, CJDC TV Sports, Dawson Creek.